Hi, in this video I will show you how you can insert check boxes or what's called tick boxes in Google Sheets. But before starting, subscribe to my channel. And now let's go and see how we can do that. So I have this table showing me the orders for some customers. And for each customer, it mentions the order number, the amount, the order date, and the payment status. And for the payment status, I want it to appear as a tick box. So if a customer completes the payment, I want the tick box to be appearing as checked next to him. But if he did not complete the payment, I want it to stay empty. So first of all, in order to do that, I need to select the cells that I want to insert the tick boxes in. Then I will go into data. And here I will go into data validation. In the criteria, I will choose tick box. Then I will press on save. Now, as you see, I have tick boxes for each of the customers. But I want to color each row based on the payment status. So, for example, if a customer pays, I want the entire row to be in green color. But if he did not pay, I want it to stay empty or I want it to appear as red. So, how to do that? I need to use the conditional formatting. And as you see, before applying conditional formatting, when the box is unticked, it appears as false. But when I tick the box, it is true. So I will start by selecting all the data here in the table. Then I will go into format and I will choose conditional formatting. Here in the format cells, if I will select custom formula is and for the custom formula I will write the formula in which I want the conditional formatting to appear so I want the formula to be applied if cell E2 which is the first cell on the checkboxes is true so I will say equals E2 equals true in this case I want the color to appear as light green as it appears here and I will press done. So now if E2 is true, you can see that conditional formatting is applied, but it's only applying to the first cell. Why is that? So if I go again to the formula, this form is applied to the first cell in the table. So when Google Sheets is comparing for B2, it will only color it if F2 is true. Same for C2, it will only color it if G2 is true so i want to fix all the comparison with respect to e2 when it's true or false in order to do that i need to put the dollar sign before e2 here so now as you see the conditional formatting is applied to the entire row rather than just to the first cell in the row and as you see whenever i check a box it will appear as green now what if i want to do the same thing but for the false ones or the empty ones. Again, format, conditional formatting, add another rule. And the rule I want to be also custom formula equals dollar sign E2 equals false. And they want the color in this case to appear as light red and press done so as you see now for the empty cells they are colored in red and it seems like here there was a change in the first formula i just need to put the dollar sign again press done and now as you see whenever a customer pays the entire row will appear as green and when he did not pay yet it will appear as red i hope this video was helpful for you don't forget to like it and share it with your friends and subscribe to my channel.